What's up everybody, Tech King Mike, back with another video. Man, it's been a minute, but we are in the building, we are in the mix, and today I wanna make a really quick video to talk to you guys about why with the new S22 lineup right around the corner, we're literally several days away from the February 25th official release of the S22, S22 Plus, and S22 Ultra. I wanna talk about why we should not forget or sleep on Galaxy S21 FE. Now, the reason why I'm doing this is because number one, I do think that if you were in the market for a low tier flagship device, you should not count the S21 FE out over the S22 FE. And I'm gonna tell you why in this video. So let's go ahead and get into it. Now, the first reason why you're going to want to consider to get the S21 over the S22 is because of the fact that this is going to have similar styling. Now, this is going to be a device that while the S22 is going to be made of complete glass, this one is going to be made of plastic with a uh, Gorilla Glass screen. However, the thing that you need to remember when you're thinking about this is that this is meant to be the cheaper of the devices, right? The S22 is meant to be the cheapest, most affordable option of the S22 lineup. In my opinion, if I had to make the decision, I would lean more into the S21 FE because of that plastic frame, I'd feel more comfortable with the money spent versus an S22 with an all glass frame. Also, you are gonna get the same styling and design with the S21 FE, like you do with the S22, AKA the camera bump now kind of sits flush and matches with the rest of the phone as far as the colors go. Also, you're gonna have the flatter side, so it's gonna give you that profile that's gonna feel very similar to the S22. Another reason why I would pick the S21 FE over the S22 is going to be a bigger screen. Now, with the S21 FE, you're getting a 6.4 inch display. With the S22, you're only getting a 6.1 inch display. So for less money, you're getting a bigger screen and it just feels like it's better when it comes when it comes to the whole grand scheme of things also for the fact that it's a 1080p display on both of them so it's not like you're really going to get that big of a difference when it comes to it another reason that i would choose the s21 fe over the s22 is the fact that you're going to get a bigger battery so when you're using your device you got to think about certain things right and when it comes to the s22 you're only going to get that 3700 milliamp hour battery whereas with the s22 fe you're going to get a much bigger battery inside of the phone so when you think about it you're getting a better battery a in in my opinion, a more durable, longer lasting build than an all glass display, a bigger screen. And although the S21 FE bears the 21 name, AKA it's a device from 2021, and it has the Snapdragon 888 instead of the uh, 8 Gen 1, you know, the new chip that's in the S22, I would argue with anyone that the 888 is not a processor to be slept on and that in this design and in this phone, it's just as good as the Snapdragon 8 Gen 1. So I personally would not steer someone away from this device just based off of specs alone. Sure, you're getting more RAM in the S22, you get eight gigs versus six gigs, but with Samsung's virtual RAM options, I don't really think that that two gigs is gonna make that big of a difference. Both of them also come in 128 and 256 when it comes to the storage, and there are several options for colors when it comes to each device, but personally, if it was my money, I'd lean towards the S21 FE over the S22. Now, camera-wise, you are gonna get some improvements on the S22, so the S21 FE may not be your cup of tea if you are looking for the best camera of the two devices, but if you're just looking for a solid bang for the buck Samsung device, Samsung device. If you're looking for the best solid bang for the buck Samsung device and you want to keep your budget on under a thousand dollars, I would say that if you're between the S22 and the S21, really and truly, you can't go wrong with either one, but personally, I would lean towards the S21 and I would say that if you can catch it on sale, which of course you can right now, it's been out for about a month, you can get some good carrier deals, you can get some good unlock deals right now. I would lean heavily into the S21 FE because I truly think that this is not a phone to be slept on. I've had this phone for about a month now and it has been in my pocket right alongside my other device that I carry with me and I have not had any issues with it. The battery has been good. I have got good experience with the cameras. The end display fingerprint scanner has been good even though it's not the ultrasonic, it's an optical display camera and I have had no issues also make sure you stay tuned to the channel to see some comparisons of this device as I will be putting it up against some of the s22 lineup here soon when those devices are released but that being said let me know down below in the comments which one would you choose would you choose the s22 or would you choose the s21 as always keep it civil keep it polite and let's have a conversation man but I will catch you guys on the next video it's your boy tech king Mike I'm out